More than 30 older adults have died this week following their inoculation of the AstraZeneca vaccine. The deaths are still being investigated to determine their connection to the COVID vaccine. One doctor says that regardless of the findings, he would recommend that certain people delay getting the jab. In the four days since AstraZeneca vaccines rolled out to older adults, more than 30 people have died after getting their shot. Although the vaccine has yet to be definitively linked to the deaths, a clinical toxicologist advises some people to delay vaccination. No matter their age, he says, people who have certain physical conditions should hold off. I think that before going to get a vaccine, you should take note of your physical condition in the past several days. If you happen to be in the middle of a cold or if you have a fever, then wait until you're feeling better to get the vaccine. After getting your shot, stay at the vaccination clinic for at least half an hour. Conditions like a fever, a cold, or a chronic illness like angina are all reasons to wait to get vaccinated because they could compound the side effects and create greater discomfort. People who need dialysis are advised to check their inflammation index before vaccination. For dialysis patients, the benefit of getting vaccinated outweighs the risks. And dialysis patients who come down with COVID-19 have a relatively high mortality rate. So in the medical field, all of us believe that dialysis patients should get vaccinated. The health minister says that if it's too hot to venture out, it might be wise to skip your appointment. Sometimes when the temperature is too high, the human body can have adverse reactions. That is to say, when it's too hot out, I'm afraid it's better to hide out or to seek out shade when you're getting the shot. Older adults are more likely to have chronic diseases. Experts say that after returning home from vaccination, older adults should closely monitor their blood pressure, temperature and glucose levels, as well as their overall cardiovascular health. Urgent medical care should be sought if a fever lasts for more than 48 hours or if the vaccine recipient has difficulty breathing, wheezing, dizziness, a rapid heartbeat or a rash that appears over the body.